topic we've been talking about it all morning happening today. It is Giving Tuesday. The United Way holds the day every year to kick off the charitable giving season. And just like its name suggests, it's all about helping those who are in need. And Chelsea Spears is in the newsroom now with Bob Hannon, president of the United Way of Youngstown and the Mahoning Valley. And good morning, guys. Dan, good morning. Well, we've just spent so much money on Black Friday, Cyber Monday, but really what better way than giving back? And that's exactly what mm -hmm. Giving Tuesday is all about. So talk to us about what Giving Tuesday mm -hmm. is for folks at home who might not be familiar with it, but also how it impacts our community here in the Valley. Well, it's a national giving day across mm -hmm. the country, but here you can give to any local charity, any local nonprofit. Uh, it's, I think, a way to reflect, to step back during the holiday season and help those that may not have as much as we have and a chance uh, to, to really support people in need. Absolutely, and spread that cheer. Now, where specifically does this money go if people are donating? What, where does it go and how does it help? So if you donate to the Youngstown Mahoney Valley United Way, the money all stays here in the Valley. Okay. Our focus is really on children and families that face barriers of success. A lot of that's the basics, food, clothing, shelter. We have 800 children in after school. They get wraparound services, academics. We feed them a warm meal every night. We take those children on field trips and try to expose them to opportunities they might not get without the support of United Way. So if you do decide to give today, one thing for sure, the money will stay right here in the Valley. That's wonderful. <laughs> and today you have specific activities planned throughout Giving mm -hmm. Tuesday. Can you talk to me about a little about what's going on? So we do work in seven after school programs, mm -hmm. seven elementary schools in the Taft Promise neighborhood. We'll be over there doing work. All the after school programs, there'll be activities going on. Our families will be there. Our children will be there. Um, so the focus really is to make the elementary school the hub of activity. Absolutely. So we have activity going going from right now, early in the morning, all the way to 7, 8 You've got a busy night. day <laughs> in store. It'll be a good day. Now talk to me too, how, what's the need like in our community compared to years past, but, but how great is this needed? How much of a need is there? I see a lot of need for basic needs. How do we help people get enough food, mm -hmm. clothing, shelter? Uh, there's still a lot of that out there, uh, especially in Youngstown. Right. Um, you know, we, we see children, we have to get them shoes. We need to get them coats. We want to make sure they have gloves. Anything the United Way focuses on with children is to eliminate the barriers so they can right. do well in school. So there is, a, there is a lot of need. You know, I live out in Poland, and sometimes I think in the suburbs we don't know what's going on in Youngstown and some of those areas right. 15 minutes away. But there is a high level of need, and our focus is really on children from birth to sixth grade and also trying to help their families Absolutely. when they need it. And so many of the things that mm -hmm. we take for granted that we have each day that some kids in our area are needing right now. So if folks at home, they're listening, mm -hmm. they want to help, how do they do that? What's the best? The easy way to, to give today is to pledge. You can go uh, and text pledge 313131. Mm -hmm. It's an easy way to give. You can always go to our website or call our office if you'd like to give to our United Way to support our work. Absolutely. Thank you so much, Bob. And again, mm -hmm. that's texting the word pledge to pound 313131. We also have a link to your United Way's mm -hmm. website on our website. You can find that right now at WKBN.com. But just know all that money is going to be going to local programs that are helping those kids in our area. Bob, thank you so much for Thanks joining for us. Us today.